Welcome to the Axiom. New file detected. Launching file. Um, okay, so... Yeah, immerse this in water for 60 seconds to find a hidden message. And... I mean, there are a lot of places where I can have water. Hang on. So let's go down to the beach. Where's my where's the ladder for the for the beach? It's this way, isn't it? I mean I'm under a waterfall, so that's that seems pretty immersed to me. And then I think I actually did see um in the guide where it was like you need page where to find page one. Um, or like how to get the like 51 to 1 uh, treasure I, it said something about the master audio so the, th the fact that it says shush I think it means I have to turn down my audio so let's see If I go to page one. Aha! Okay, let me turn my audio back up. Uh, options, audio. I thought it had been 60 seconds. Oh. I need to keep my audio off, apparently. Turning up the audio will mean instant removal of the message. So let me redo that. Okay. So this says the, the softest. I don't know why the line's interrupted there. The softest. Oh, the lines are interrupted multiple places. Fa I'm having to turn multiple pages now. Feather. Softest feather. Is this going to be a haiku? <laughs> because it looks like it's structured like a haiku. Um, corrected. Why are there these gaps in these lines? The softest feather. Oh, that's why. Because it's actually spelling out the syllables. <laughs> so like the softest feather. Uh, corrected. L. 11. 11 times departed once more hmm the softest feather corrected 11 times departed once more and it has the that part of the island okay now it's no longer immersed in water do i need to keep my volume down if i stand here and do it is something else going to happen and keep my volume down all right well the message is here The softest 
feather corrected eleven times departed once more. Maybe I turn my volume up one? So the message is still there. I'm not sure what to do. Even like I did not look at the full entry for the guide, so I'm not I'm still not quite sure where to go from here. Maybe turn my volume back down. Maybe the softest feather corrected eleven eleven times. Well it says the So fifty one Yeah, revealing the secret message. So, the treasure has to do with this. What does that mean? The softest feather corrected 11 times? That implies maybe there's 11 notes. Um, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. I genuinely have no idea. Maybe it's this. Maybe I need to do this. Up, right, down, left, down, left, down, left, down, left, up. I don't know. Do the syllables somehow translate to north, south, east, west? I don't know what to do here, <laughs> genuinely. Um, tell you what. I know how to access this. I'll come back to it. Let me look up the solution for the remaining two fairies first before I do this. So let me turn, get my audio back. Oh. That. Okay. Man. Okay, that's confusing. So, according to... This. According to the guide, one of the fairies, the one that doesn't involve the golden door, can is only accessible at night. Which is unusual, because every other fairy can be accessed at any time of the day. So I would not have thought to do that. But yeah, I'll be right back. Okay, yeah, it's this guy. Hang on, okay. Doing his little dance. Alright, so. I'm watching. Up. Down. Up. Down. Left. Right. Left. Right. Down, left, up, right, and he's done. What do you say? I'm dancing. Is that what that says? Dan? Is that a? Ah? Yeah, that's a. Ah. I'm dancing the dance of the Holy Cross. I'm d <laughs> okay. That's really funny. I would not have. Unless I came here at night, I would not have gotten this. But, okay, so up, down, up, down, da, 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 da. Hey, thanks, man. I appreciate you. All right, let's switch it back today. All right, and this other one, I'm more... 
wondering where the pieces are because I found three out of the four pieces, but I don't know where the fourth one is. So fairy number 20. Okay, there it is. Oh, okay, yeah. I... Okay. So immediately after entering the West Garden. Yeah, the West Garden would have actually been one of the last places I would have looked because I did not know whether or not I would have gotten that far. So... I was actually kind of close. So do 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 do. Okay. So now back to the east forest. Okay. So hopefully I have this. So. No. Okay. Maybe it's the other way. I know I have it. I know I have all the pieces, and I think I have it correct. Oh no, I drew it wrong. That's what that, that's what's wrong. <laughs> um, I'm looking at the pictures on the guide, so I'm not looking at the actual like solution, but I'm looking at the pictures of the statue, and I put in an extra zigzag. So this should be correct. <laughs> All right. Whoops. Okay. Um, there we go. Yeah, I <laughs> I was stupid. I put in an extra zigzag on the uh, um, thing, and that's why it was wrong. <laughs> okay. Well, we found all the fairies. Now let's go back and we can get that treasure from them. Hi. That's really cool. So it's like a lily or something? Alright, and then as far as I know, the only other treasure is this, uh... Letter one. Okay, so I need to stand here. And then what does this. Okay, so the softest feather corrected 11 times, departed once more. So I guess let me go ahead and turn my volume back down. I mean, there's an up arrow. I think I might just look it up because I'm at a loss. <laughs> Here, let me just see what the solution for this is and then see if I can figure out how it arrived at, at that solution. So, yeah, after sit, you'll see a new drawing appear at the bottom right of the page indicating where you will find the secret treasure chest along with a secret message that serves as instructions. You're now ready to input the code by using the D-pad. The code is down right 11 times and left 12 times? I mean, I was doing that. I was hitting... I hit... 11... I hit... Um, right 11 times i hit left 11 times why does it start with down the softest feather corrected 11 times 
No, it's not a maze. I don't know. I don't know where that solution comes from because I get the like the 11. I don't know. But down 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12. Let me turn my volume back up. Yeah, like I... Like the, the 11 times, corrected 11 times, I figured there was either 11 inputs total or one button hit 11 times. But I do not know why it starts with down or south because I don't know yeah I'm not sure feel free to explain that one to me in the comments because I like the 11 times I was getting like I said but starting with down and then left 12 times i'm not sure down feathers the softest feather is a down feather i realized it right after i finished this recording session tv Okay, so now we go to the trophy room and we unsing the golden path. I'm going the wrong way. This feels really good. Seeing it like this. All right, traverse the glow. Unsing the golden path. All right, so we're singing it backwards. And are all of the all of the golden things are glowing? I wonder if that is because I got all of the treasures. So let's go ahead and sing the golden path backwards. So. Oh. I saw things were happening on the screen out of the corner of my eye. I might have messed it up. No, I definitely messed it up. Hang on, let me... Let me go back in. So... Uh, interesting, okay. So the letters are appearing as I'm doing this, but I can't look because I'm looking at my notes. Da, 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 da. And this spells out... Do I need to unscramble this or something? Okay, let's see if I can unscramble this. If I did it correctly. So this is... I'm not sure what that word is. Maybe if I start... Do I need to start, like, from here? So... That's... R? Uh, that's... That is Rue. Cha? M? Mo? No, it's Ohm. Uh... Rue, Cha, Ohm. This is... 
I don't think that's a symbol. Here, let me go back and try it one more time. Okay. So. We have... Uh, uh, da, 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 da. Okay. Uh, so yeah, okay, that's, that, I, I'm 99% sure I did it correctly. I was trying to go slower that time. That still says Rue. That still says Cha. That still says Om. Maybe I messed up because again, this is not a symbol that exists. This is also not a symbol. <laughs> Wait, now it says something different. Maybe I had messed it up before. So now it says Moo. Nope, I think I still messed it up because that's not a symbol. Maybe instead of unsing, like doing the song backwards, maybe I need to do the opposite of every note. So it would be, in that case, it would be, uh. Oh boy. Down, right, up, right, down, right, down. Okay, let's see what nonsense this has yielded us. <laughs> and I don't know what that is, but at least they were all symbols this time. Is this nonsense? What is this? Do I go back? I mean, I could also try the extreme of doing it the song backwards and doing every direction backwards. So let's try that. Up, left, down, left, up. What does that yield? Are these supposed to be random or no? That, this can't be correct. Like, how many... <sighs> Just because I'm so close to the end, I'm gonna make sure I'm doing it right. So... Tunic... Un... Sing... What? Hang on. Hang on. If you have a page... After... Page 49... Flip the page... that all the directions are now mirrored. And I did that. I think. And I got Haje or Goboma I I got gibberish. Oh. So Unsing doesn't mean flip all directions. It just means flip the puzzle horizontally? So you look at the golden path on the other side of the page, or in other words, mirrored. Okay, so I need to... Can I do that with my current setup? Can I, like, if I take this page and hold up to the light, can I see a mirror of the golden path? Kind of. So that means I, I, if I look at it regular-wise, up and down stay the same, left and right are flipped. I don't know... I'm glad I looked up a guide for that, because I would never have guessed that. 
Because, yeah, I was thinking opposites of all the directions. I was thinking the song backwards. I would not have thought to mirror it. So let me start it over. Okay. So, yeah, I need to start from the inside, which I was doing, but then I need to also mirror it. So it would be down, left, down, right, right, down, left, down, left, down, left, up, left, left, up, left, down, left, up, left, down. Well, that isn't... That's definitely not correct. Let me see if I can see through my scribbles and, like, ignore the stuff that I have on this page and actually look through. Okay, so... Down, left, down, right, right, down, left, down... Okay. So now what does it say? Hang on, I need to, if I get it right, is it actually supposed to say something? Oh. So I must have gotten it wrong again because it is, the message begins south of the tower's entrance. So yeah, I was right in thinking it would start with this, but I keep getting it wrong. Okay, so this is an ARG. Uh, apparently, because I I keep getting it wrong, so I'm just going to stop here, especially now that I know what this is. So, the message is supposed to spell out, Do you fear the eyes of the far shore? And it's a, apparently it's a URL, and if you go to it, you see a, like, monster uh with those like tentacles like the mo the one of the monsters that is uh like the tentacle monsters that are on the base of that tower uh and they have eyes that resemble the three tower keys and then if you check the source code for the website i can download an audio file and then Uh, if I examine the audio file in a spectrogram, I get the message, We are the eyes of the far shore. And the source code under the details also says, Thank you for playing. And like, you, if you look at the details in the, of the audio file. So yeah, um, I... That is very interesting, but... I keep getting this wrong. This is... I don't know why I keep getting it wrong, but... Yeah, the way I have it drawn, I think I would have to redraw it if I really wanted to, like, mirror it. So I think that's where we're going to end that. And I think in order to end the game... Do I put... Am I right about me putting the manual in the mailbox? So I guess it is optional, because I, I didn't end up sharing my wisdom with those creatures. <laughs> but let's see if I'm right about this. Can I put the manual in the mailbox? This is different. Is it? No, it's not. Hang on. At least one more thing for you to do. If this is your final page, you pay a visit to a certain... Oh, the shopkeeper. Maybe? Or the... Maybe it's the air? Let me try the shopkeeper first. Can I share my wisdom with you? Doesn't make a whole lot of sense that I would be able to, actually. Let me go to the air. Because if I share my wisdom with him...
Pay a visit to a certain someone and share your wisdom. The air makes the most sense to me. Besides, I'm trying to think of all the NPCs that I can actually interact with that are important. So let's go to the air and let's share our wisdom. I guess it is, like, it would be poetic, like the ending it would be... Hi. Can I share my wisdom with you? Or are you going to try to fight me? Oh. You're not trying to fight me. Hi. No, you're still trying to fight me? No, this is different. Yeah, look at my cool book. So now you know about the cycle. Oh, I love this. It's not a remix, but it's like a... It's the air's track, but... Different. Okay. Oh, we got all the tre uh, we're using all the treasures too. <laughs> uh Oh, the symbols are like their roles in the game. Oh, this is so cute! Look at them sharing the world together. So... This was... What can I say about it that I haven't already said? This game's amazing. Um, everything from the puzzles, to the combat, to the exploration, to the art style, to the music, to the manual mechanic, it was all done so well, so incredibly well, and Yeah, I think I I really ended up clicking with it for the vast majority of the experience. I managed to master the combat really well. I um, translated the language. I found a bunch of secrets. Like, I don't know. I just had such an amazing time with this game. And I feel like I feel... Like, I feel proud of myself for the way that I played. Um, if that makes any sense. Like, I just, I feel like I played this game really well. Um, and, yeah, the way the music enhanced the theme, like, enhanced the exploration by not being too in your face. And the way the combat was simple, um, yet like like easy to learn, difficult to master, but 
it allowed for experimentation um, when it came to consumables and stuff like that. Uh, the way the puzzles incorporated the environmental design reminded me a lot of The Witness, and I really enjoyed that. Um, again, the puzzles, the puzzles at the end, uh, I don't want to try to defend myself from using a guide. I always want to go into it with the mindset that it is okay to use a guide if you get stuck. Um, the end. New Game Plus. Copy, save, and carry most items in New Game Plus. Um, but anyway, uh, with these last few puzzles, yeah, I, uh, I don't regret using a guide. Um, I still had things that were surprises. Uh, yeah, those, those last few puzzles were just... <laughs> uh, I m might have been able to figure them out given more time, but... I really, uh, I didn't want to spend like hours and hours trying to like explore all over the map and getting lost and, um, stuff like that. I, I felt like it would be better to just solve it and get to the end. Um, and I think it was worthwhile. The, I had no idea this game had an ARG. Um... I think that's really cool. That's not something I usually engage with <laughs> when, it, when it comes to games. Um, so I am glad that I uh, looked that up. Um, but yeah, the main thing is I don't want you guys uh, to be like um, upset that I used a guide. So, which is why I'm trying so hard to like explain myself. I know that, that there are some people who are probably going to be upset no matter what that I used a guide for the last few puzzles. Um, but the vast majority of you are probably not going to care all that much. Uh, but yeah, it is what it is. I still had an amazing time with this game. I hope you guys had an amazing time with this game as well. Um, yeah, the person who recommended this to me said that this was a another once in a lifetime or yeah, like once in a lifetime game. Uh a completely unique experience from start to finish. And yeah, I loved every second of it. This is easily one of my favorite games that I've played on the channel and maybe one of my favorite games overall. It's definitely high up there, that's for sure. So, yeah, if you guys have any more suggestions for games that you would like to see me play on the channel, please leave them in the comments below. I am constantly adding new games to my list. I'm currently into the 800s uh, when it comes to the amount of games uh, that I have their names saved on my phone. Um, so there's plenty of there's plenty of options for me to choose from and I very much encourage adding more. Um, if you would like to follow me on Twitter at Axiom Archives, I don't really use the account, but if you feel so inclined, feel free to follow me on there. Um, and yeah, if you haven't already, please uh, consider subscribing and we can have more experiences like this together in the future, hopefully. So yeah. Without further ado, this is going to be the end for Tunic. So thank you everybody so much for checking out the video. I really do appreciate it. If you want to be notified of when I upload the start of a new file to the archives, go ahead and hit the uh, go ahead and hit the subscribe button and ring that bell, as well as leave a like or comment if you so desire. Thanks again, and I will see you next time. Upload successful. Click here to view previous files. Have a pleasant day.